Why, 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 why? Ain't this a bitch? Somebody making videos about football. Hmm. You got your, I guess, your favorite football player on this YouTube, or maybe that's yourself. I'm not commenting on this video with the football highlights because I'm a football fan. I'm commenting on that sorry ass comment that you made on the bottom of my page. Everybody knows that fucking dress was inappropriate, but the comment that you made on my bottom of my page is inappropriate. You need to understand exactly why I made the comments I made. We both know that dress was inappropriate, but to argue with a child was stupid. How the fuck you gonna argue with somebody who you know is in the wrong? You tend this person home. Send her home. You know what? You can go to your prom, change the dress. You go buy something and cover this up. No. Instead of compromising with a child, you start yelling and tripping with a child. Somebody saw all the little arguing and shit, and the child had to be handcuffed. I'm not commenting on the fact that the dress was wrong, because you know the dress was wrong. But if you watch America's Top Model, if you look in these fucking magazines and shit, and everything you see, that shit is all right. Yeah. In any other realm but the fucking prom, the shit is fine. The shit is fine. I don't care about the dress. It's the person I gave a damn about. Because just because somebody is in the wrong, that don't mean you perpetuate the situation by treating a person like shit. If an idiot walks in the room and his clothes is on fire, don't tell the motherfucker that his clothes is on fire. Put the motherfucker out. And in saying that, what do you do? You cover the motherfucker up. So these people, these grown-ups who are in charge, could not tell this child to cover themselves up. So instead of uh, trying to, to deal with a kid, they, 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 they called the police on the child. So my comment was on the handcuffs. The dress was fine. So if you don't like the, what I'm saying, fuck you. I'm commenting on your video because your shit is lame. So before... You call somebody perverted and make statements like that. Understand from the person's perspective why they said what they said. Life is already fucked up for black people. For people to go around calling one of us a whore, a tramp, a slut, and, and all kind of hookers and shit. The girl was only fucking 17 years old. Tell her, you know, the dress wasn't fine, wasn't, wasn't good for the job. The dress, you, you can go to the pool, it wasn't a dress. It was a two-piece, looked like a fucking swimsuit. Cover that shit up. That's all I said, but that makes me perverted. Motherfucker, why you sitting back and watching booty me and uh, jacking off to fucking bullshit? Think about it. You think about yourself before you call somebody pervert. I know what you've been watching on YouTube. Everybody can see it. So please, perverted. Ain't that a bitch. Telling somebody to cover somebody else up because they're not dressed right is perverted. Telling somebody that they should get the best out of their life, regardless of whatever, that's perverted. Telling somebody not to damage somebody else's self-esteem is fucking perverted. Because if that was your little sister or, or your cousin, you know she wouldn't have went out the house like that. But if she had a went out the house like that, don't you think it would be way better and in her best interest to be told, fix yourself. But instead, if somebody calls your sister or any family member you got a slut, a tramp, a whore, a hooker, a crack hoe, you would say the same shit I'm saying. Instead of calling this person out their name, why don't you tell this person to cover themselves up? The story is dead and gone. And I'm finna cancel or uh, finna stop all comments being made to this shit because I'm pretty much tired of this shit. And I'm not going to comment on this no more because I said I wasn't going to do it no more. But the next time some little faulty ass motherfucker with one video on their goddamn page want to bump his motherfucking gums, if you got something smart to say or something uh, stupid, you got the power to put a video up. Don't be a bitch. Put a camera in front of yourself and say what the fuck you got to say. If not, choose a bitch. Yeah, a punk ass bitch. And that's why I'm commenting on your best video. You lucky. Because if this was YouTube jail, I'd be fucking you off right now. So please. Make your comments in a manner to where they're going to show respect. You could have told me I was wrong without calling me perverted. See, people got this fucking shit twisted. You got this shit fucking twisted. 
You know if that girl walked up to you at the pool with that shit on, that bitch could have seen every one of your goddamn teeth. Excuse me. I'm not going to call her a bitch. That was wrong. That girl would have saw every one of your damn fucking teeth walking up on your sorry ass. Shit. And yes, she came off undesirable. She was wrong. Motherfucker, that don't give you the right to tell me I'm a pervert because I'm telling people to cover the girl up and let her go to her fucking prom. But like I said, if you got the power to put your little, uh, your greatest football highlights up, you got the power to put a camera in front of your face and say what you had to write. Say what you fucking typed in. And if you didn't do it, don't let people use your fucking computer to type hateful shit in. While you gone, the next motherfucker on YouTube calling people bitches and hoes and shit. And you come home, and you gotta watch your video highlights because you done lost something. You ain't how you used to be. And then you say, oh, I was a reply to my video highlights. And you got somebody like me telling you off. And you probably ain't even wanna type this shit in the bottom of the screen. But if you are, you a cowardly bitch. And if you can't express yourself in video by showing your face. Wait a minute. Fuck, I need to turn another light on or something. You see my face? Let me see. Let me back, see. You know what? Just go through my other videos. I'm pretty sure you have. You saw my face in that video. So you're the last fucking parasite I'm going to deal with. I'm going to go straight to this video right now, you sorry son of a bitch, and cancel all comments to the video. Because if you got to say stupid shit, then on oh, you just gave me an idea. You just gave me a motherfucking brilliant idea. I'm going to see if I can contact somebody at YouTube and fix it so there will only be video responses allowed on certain videos. Thanks to your sorry ass, I'm going to start shutting motherfuckers down. Oh, by the way, there were some sick ass highlights. You know that one play? That one play was off the fucking hook. But hey, Milton Harris, number 27. I'll be looking for you in the NFL. But, don't bring your computer with you. Because you won't like the critiques other people are going to give you. So, um, maybe you want to pretend like you're not who you are. Put a mask in front of your face. Uh, or put a picture up and talk. <sighs> oh, you fucking bore me.